Sometimes we'll get on tangents and it's like, th this is dumb. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And, and you just, you blow it away. Yeah. But so we're going to do our, our top three bargain bourbons uh, because like, you know, I'm pretty sure the rest of you guys, just like we are, uh, the economy's tight and bourbon's getting more expensive. And Leon's getting larger. And so we thought we'd do a show on Hey, what are some cheap bourbons that you can get that are really tasty and you can go out and buy and not blow the blow the bank out of? So, okay. and but, we also needed a chance to get together. That, that's <laughs> but says dear viewer, what exactly is bourbon bottles of bourbon? Do you speak English? English. Bargain. 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 But what is blah, blah, blah. what is a bargain bottle of bourbon? So we have to define that, I guess. Really. Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. So we need to. So a bargain bottle of bourbon would be a bourbon that is easily you can go out and get. It's not too hard to get. There might be one, some on the fringe here, but it's a bourbon that you can you can easily readily get. Uh, and then price range, uh, I think we kept it under thirty five. Is that right? Under. Uh, well, yeah, actually, under thirty-five. Under thirty-five. Yeah. So we kept it under thirty-five dollars. Uh, yeah. Was our was our range? So from anywhere from zero, if someone gives it to you, which that's no nation like donation. You want me to make a donation to the Coast Guard Youth Auxiliary? <laughs> or up to thirty-five dollars. <laughs> All right. Your well, first one. Let's go one at a time. All right. That's yeah. what Josh and I are sipping on. Yep. Benchmark <clears throat> and not one and eight or top four or whatever. I mean, benchmark foolproof. You're not going to find a foolproof that is at this cost. It comes in at a whopping $22.99 on the shelf, and it sits at 125 proof. So you are looking at a pretty hefty bourbon. Yeah. That's going to give you a lot of good full flavors. It's got it's the most leaded, obviously, of the of the benchmark series. Yeah. And. I've seen some channels actually blind this between stag and this one. The hell are you say? Mm -hmm. Yeah, dead serious. And so I mean, it's it is a solid, solid foolproof. I've been along the weather. 125 proof is like, wham! Yeah, it's hit. It's hitting me like exactly. <laughs> I mean, I'm just like, holy crap! So um, okay, well, so uh, we got the the benchmark foolproof. Uh, my first one. Who will go away? Yeah, that one. Ooh, it does, doesn't it? <laughs> that is. Boy, that is a. That's your first. That's creamy, your first drink. That's my first sweet drink. Yeah. Probably should have started off with that, but man, that is a creamy caramel bomb. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I would go even higher on the caramel, uh, the caramel factor for this one, but Knob Creek Nine. This is a hundred, a hundred proof, um, and this one. To me, is is not only is it a, a bargain bear, uh, bourbon as far as I'm concerned, but on top of that, it's easy to find where we are here in Ohio. And three, um, it is super good. It's, you know, it's it's from the Jim Beam family, so it's got that sweet, nutty, caramely you know uh, flavor to it that you just that, that's a winner. So to me, this is this is right on. Uh, what's what, what what was the price on this? This like, one's thirty four ninety nine. So this is probably going to be the peak of our. Of our cost yeah. for but thirty four ninety nine. This is our top shelf <laughs> bargain bourbon. <laughs> bargain bourbon. <laughs> so, so, anyways, <laughs> this is this is a, a definitely a home run. All right. Oh, how I'm about your first one? It's my turn. It is your first one. Seventeen ninety two. Can go wrong with seventeen ninety two. And, and uh, a small batch. Yeah. And and it's very good. Uh, I, I don't have a whole lot of, as you know. I don't get into great depth in my analysis of the taste. <laughs> but, th th there we go. Well, Why do so many there you go. Sure, sure. So, but, um, th th a lot of people compare this as having an uh, alternative to Blanton's. Uh, uh, to me, uh, this is a really, just a It's just a good for it's, it's, it's It yeah. is. It's just nice, smooth, good Sunday sipper type of thing. Yeah, yeah. You know, that's a good you're, point. You're, gonna, you're, you're not going to go wrong. It's, it's going to give you like the nice little, those nice little barrel notes, but nothing cumbersome or anything. This yeah. isn't going to come in and smack you in the mouth like a good old 125 proof for here. And it's only 93.7 proof, so it's not going to belch across the room. But yeah, like like uh, the benchmark would. Did I just say that? What is it? Jibu is usually a glitch in the matrix. 
It happens when they change something. I think so. Did you see that? Okay, so what, what, what's the, the small batch? I think this is like thirty-two dollars, right? Thirty-four ninety-nine. Thirty-four ninety-nine. So that one's also so, a little yeah. more. These are our two high marked uh, yeah. bottles that we're going to have up yeah. here. So, but this one used to be a little bit more difficult to find in Ohio, but we're finding it more regularly. I, I yeah. last year was it was there was moments where I couldn't find it at all. Mm -hmm. Then then this year it's been a lot. Of, lot it's been easier to find. If we can ever find their foolproof or their, you know, uh, their weeded, uh, I'd be all, I'd be super happy to find that because I have not been able to find those ones. But that's yeah. there's a small batch. Okay, how about your second one? Then? Okay, so my second one, um, we'll we'll stick with the uh, high proofs, and we'll go with Old Granddad 114. There you go. Coming in. That's a winner. <clears throat> at 32. That, that is a winner. Yeah, coming in at 32.99. This one, uh, you know, a lot of people like the Bonded. Uh, the Bonded is a cinnamon bomb, uh, really nice and tasty. This one backs up, backs off the cinnamon punch, but just comes in. Actually, I find that this one at 114 drinks a lot easier than the Bonded mm -hmm. does. And yeah, I definitely agree with you. I agree with you. And it makes I as well with mellow corn. <laughs> yeah, oh my I, I would say that that's the top of the line on the uh, old granddad series. On the old granddad series, yeah. easily. I yeah. agree with you. Well, when we did our blind tournament, this made it all the way to the uh, some ways to the finals. It made it to the finals. It made it to the finals. Yeah. So, uh, and and we were really surprised about that. But it, it is. Yeah. Uh, but it had to win the losers bracket to make it in. Right. So it lost our. It, it made it, it. lost out. Was in the losers bracket. And made it all the way to the finals. So yeah. um, now that one I think is what thirty two. Thirty-two ninety-nine. Yeah, thirty-two ninety-nine. So, so again, you know, we're we're, we're tiptoeing around the thirty-dollar range, but again, you can go get these pretty much anywhere, and you, you know, you're gonna have a nice sip out of that. Oh, so my second one, uh, it, this this is this is your classic. I can do just about anything with it. Bourbon. Uh, it's it's Wild Turkey 101, and the reason we have I have that one up there is it's a good, easy, neat sipper. It's also good you know having it you know on the rocks and i think it makes a really wonderful old fashioned so you know this bottle is really because of those old fashions this one goes a lot quicker for me um yeah. but this th it's it you know it doesn't taste like it doesn't drink like a 101 no. if, if that's hot for you um but it, it, this, is a, this is a great bird and, and it's a great introduction to wild turkey products it, it, definitely it, it is a nice little gateway to sit there and say oh you like this well, you might like some rare breed yeah you know I, you mean Russell's? That too, I guess. No, no, no. Russell's. <laughs> All right. All right! Knock that shit off! <laughs> so, um, but anyways, uh, really enjoy it. I think you just bought one, and you were like, oh, this is really good. I, 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 I had a, uh, a bottle of uh, the, the 101 Rye, yeah. which, which is excellent. <clears throat> uh, and I, I, I didn't remember. I, well, I just didn't have a bottle of it, and I got it. And it I'm enjoying it. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. a good one. And that one, I think, is this was like 25 bucks. Yeah, 24 dollars Yeah, so like this, that's like, that's nothing. So, yeah, it's one of those ones, too. Like, when you, if, you, if you've been off of it for a while, then you return to it, it knocks your socks off. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh, this also did well in our blind. Uh, uh, yeah, I think it made it to the quarters. It did. So, so, and I think it had, it was either Russell's or, or it had to be beaten by one of its own products. I think it was either Russell's or the rare breed that knocked it out. Yeah, I can't remember. Yeah. So, but anyways, but that's, you know, that, that would be my second one. Excellent bottle to, to grab right there. All right, you're number two. Okay, number two, it used to be really tough to get. Yeah. But it's on, on the shelf more these days. It's still not Thank super. God. It's yeah. It's not super easy to get, but it is worth considering as a, a favorite Buffalo Trace. Buffalo Trace. Yeah, it's great. I, well, I, I love it. I, I that that uh, in, in price what price wise that's the second least costly bottle of bourbon that I've got. Yeah, well, I think it's twenty five bucks. Yeah. Um, what what what's what, what is we a lot of people call us a beginner's bourbon. And the reason that it's, uh, we would call it a beginner's bourbon uh, is the low proof, not any proof, um, but it's extremely sweet. Uh, it's got, it, it's super smooth. And again, this is another one that you can take and mix with. You can, you, you know, kind of like the Wild Turkey 101, you can, it it's mixes very well in, in, in mixed drinks. It's nice and uh, I like drinking it neat. 
Um, and when you don't come, when you leave it alone for a while and then come back to it, it all of a sudden you're like, wow, that was that's really good. Yeah, for, it's like you missed an old friend. It, it is, it, yeah. it, and it's it's and so, but yeah. these, these two bottles, when you sit there and you come back to them after a time, yeah, you you just sit there and think, you mean like, like this is twenty six ninety nine, twenty four ninety nine, and the complexity in there when you pour a glass of it belays the price. It, you you wouldn't expect that price of a bourbon to give you some some complexity like that. Yeah, and that's that's one of the things. Most for the most part, Buffalo Trace with all their bourbons does a really good job of doing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the reason that's more available now is Buffalo Trace has opened up another still, and so they're pro over, they're producing a lot more. And and I think they're also opening up. They're winning some of those battles of distri distribution mm -hmm. in the in the courtroom, and so that's helping helping out. Uh, with that distribution, so that's what, probably why we see a little bit more of it. And um, that may not be in all locations. That's uh, that's Ohio. Yeah, right, correct. So hopefully that keeps coming through because that's a bottle that I will probably always have on my shelf. So the bottle I've got is the big one. I, I keep a biggie and I I love it. Go big go home. Home. Go big, go home. <laughs> all right, so you're a third one. All right, my third one is. Cooper's Craft 100. Hot dog all. It is so good. So just deep. I I, I got a bottle of this thinking, okay, give it a shot. I'll give it a shot. It you know, heard some good things about it on some on some YouTubes. You know, gave it a shot, poured it into a glass, and thought, where have you been all my life? <laughs> Well, it, it, it is a, um, I think it's probably one of the most underrated bourbons probably on this table, even even of all bourbons. It, it's, it surprises you, you know, yeah. it's, you, you you get a little bit more flavor than $33.99. I agree with um, that, definitely. You know, I, I could see this going in the realm of like 45 to 50 bucks. Yeah. Um, it's it's just very good. Don't very give them any ideas. We don't need to give them any ideas. Yeah. So listen, oh, this is perfectly priced, ladies and gentlemen. It would be better at eighteen ninety nine. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's what we're. No. All these bourbons donation should be like donation. <laughs> <laughs> all these bourbons should be fifteen dollars. That's what I think. <laughs> right. Exactly. I'm looking at you, Barrel. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> Their owners are going, <laughs> right? <laughs> Suck it. Yeah, they're, they're laughing hard. Yeah. It's like they're watching um, us. <laughs> yeah, right. If they are, like and subscribe. Come yeah. on, what's up? Um, I, I, I would say that this is probably, man, if we were to go across, this is probably one of my more favorite ones. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty happy with these two right here. And that one, I don't own a bottle. I should. That's probably sacrilegious to my bar. We'll fix that. Okay, that, if, if you see it, then that'd be great. But this is... It's all over I, 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 I just haven't picked it up. I just haven't. But anyways, this is... this is uh, you, you, You're right to, right to choose it. It's, it's an excellent yeah. bourbon. So, okay, my number two. Uh, three. Or three, number three. And this one's a little bit harder to find uh, if you're not in Ohio. Uh, it's a little bit easier here in Ohio. Um, it's, uh, <laughs> it's just all over the place. Is it right now? You, you on, on a Saturday, which is the the, the two major stores that I, that I go to in Hilliard and Dublin, in, in Hilliard and Dublin, which is in Columbus area, in yeah. Columbus, okay. area. yeah. Uh, but anyway, in it every every Saturday there's a dump, just yeah. a, just about, yeah, with a lot of with all the with see and, and and I don't go out every every Saturday, but you know again, here's the thing, we were. You and I were doing this mostly. We were, it was Weller, we're drinking Weller, 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 and then I think we got kind of tired of it, to be very honest with yeah. you. That's and then about exactly. about two weeks ago, we had a sip of it, and it was like, what, what's going on? Yeah, you, this you, is ridiculously. You cool. gave me a sip, and I it, and I was blind, and it, and I yeah. said, wow, that's yeah, great. That's great. And and so here we are. You know, we kind of don't give it to again this is another buffalo trace product i mean we're talking 25 bucks right 25 is it still uh, 26 now, so know. everything's kind of gone up everything's up about a buck two dollars and but uh if you can find it this is probably the hardest one to find out of the group but this one for the price 26 dollars are you adding you, you're adding mine if you don't want, want to pick it up it's really good uh again this is not 
you know, the other wellers, you know, the, you get other nice good things from weller like 107 Antique or, or you know, the, the, 12. the, the yeah, the 12, the, um, oh. the, the full proof, whatever. And those are wonderful, but from a, from a bargain bourbon, that's a home run for as far as I'm concerned. So, good. Okay, your third and final. Third and final. This is going to shock every one of our viewers that watch us religiously. The, the, this will shock mo most all of them. Yes. And, and not only that, uh, if they haven't tried it, they're crazy. It's, <laughs> it's worth a shot. <clears throat> uh, this, and I, oh, I brought my big one. That's what she said. Well, Evan, that's what she said. Evan Williams. <laughs> Had a good uh, this, this is a, this is bottled and bond. It, so 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 it's 100 proof. Uh, it's an excellent bourbon. Uh, it's the the cheapest on the on the lot. Um, so 1999. 1999. Not that size. Not that size. The smaller. Yeah, the smaller one, which is the, the same. 750 mils. 1999. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and it's uh, it's worth any, every penny. So it, it's it's excellent. And not to dog it. I would say out of all of these, it's probably my least favorite because it's not as as deep, I think, as it's the rest deep. of them. But it's not a it's not a deep, a deep bourbon. That's but for, sure. for 19.99, uh, if you can find a bottle and bond for 19.99, okay. And and again, if you're on a budget, you want to have something to enjoy. You can't go wrong there. For you know, you know, okay, I got 20 bucks and I want to have a I want to have a that's bourbon. Right. You know, I want to have a bourbon. I got 20 bucks. That's all. That's it. You can go get Evan Williams up bottled and bond, so you know you're going to get 100 proof. It's going to be a little bit fuller than some of the other things that you can find. That's a home. It, it, for it's a home run. Yeah. Um, I I don't have a bottle anymore because you know I, I just haven't gonna. But you know what I would should do is I should take that and turn it into um, an old fashioned. Not yours, but I'll, I'll go buy one and make some old fashions out of it. I bet you it makes it an old fashioned. I probably would. It, comment down below if you've had Evan Williams old, with an old fashioned. I have not. Uh, I'd be interested in trying that. I might, I might snag a, a sniff by that before then. That, that's so, fun. So, all right. Well, there you go. That's, so that's the crowd. That's it. That so here. Th these are just our selections. So we're just trying to help give some ideas to. Hey, here's a bargain. This is where you want to go. This is the bourbons that we can help you out with that will help you on a price pinch. And you want to have. You want to sit down, and sip on some on some bourbon. Yeah. Help us out. What do you have yeah. on your on your bargain list, and what, what how would you define price wise what your bargain list is? Do you have some, a lot that are cheaper than ours, and how do you recommend those? Because you know we're pretty dumb. We'll take suggestions. <laughs> <laughs> Always we'll take suggestions, only because I think that I like the community. I like yeah, I like, absolutely. I like the yeah. chatter. I enjoy I enjoy people reaching out so and, and having that talk so. Yep. All right, gang. Well, hey, thanks a lot again for tuning in. We appreciate it, and we'll catch you on the next one. It's for all bourbon. Catch you guys later. See ya.